What began as a cost-effective method to test sensor systems in the 1960s has evolved into an essential ingredient for sensor design and testing in the 1990s. The Missile Engagement Simulation Arena, also known as MESA, looks like a big metal box. 405 feet long, 150 feet wide, 90 feet high, built with 4,000 tons of steel and 17,000 cubic yards of concrete. Today's modern weapon development demands precise evaluation and verification of highly sophisticated interactions between targets and missile sensors. Sensors include RF and optical target detecting devices and may be expanded to include missile seekers. The Department of Defense required a new, modern facility with advanced capabilities to deal with the evolution of new airborne threats and the development of new anti-air weapons. Located at the Naval Air Warfare Center Weapons Division at China Lake, MESA fulfills this requirement. At MESA, all important properties of sensor-target interaction can be simulated and measured accurately and at a lower cost and more precisely than at any other test and evaluation facility. This facility can accommodate full or subscale target models or actual gutted airframes weighing up to 25,000 pounds. The target is suspended from either the mid-range or the downrange overhead target supports. The target can be set at a wide range of yaw, pitch, and roll angles and translated to within one-eighth of an inch of the desired position. In less than one minute, the target can be repositioned. This flexibility in target and sensor position permits wide variations of missile and target geometry. The sensor model can be a modified target detecting device or the MESA instrumentation radar. The sensor is mounted on a three-axis positioner and moved past the target along the relative velocity vector. Since high-speed intercepts are not practical in the laboratory, the sensor transporter is moved at scaled speeds of 1 to 10 feet per second. Digitized sensor data are recorded and available on a variety of computer formats. Processed data are available immediately for review by the customer. Post-processing of data provides information about sensor declaration point and missile effectiveness. Result, precise, accurate data unobtainable by any other means at so low a cost. Alternative test and evaluation methods for missile fuses include full-scale missile test firings. Flyover tests, supersonic sled runs, and pull by tests. But each of these methods has their drawbacks. Targets may be restricted to available drones or U.S. aircraft. Some methods require a costly design engineering investment to produce testable prototype sensor models. The knowledge and control of intercept geometry may be poor and violent movement can limit sensor output monitoring. But in the laboratory environment at MESA, with all-weather, round-the-clock operation, the cost of data to evaluate a weapon system, typically thousands of intercepts, is significantly less than the cost of data from only one missile firing, and with more precise data as the result. In addition, the downrange target support 
facilitates future evaluation of guidance integrated fusing and terminal guidance concepts. MESA will be in direct support of projects for the entire Department of Defense and their contractors. The Missile Engagement Simulation Arena at China Lake provides critically needed and improved capability to perform missile engagement simulations. With the low cost, high accuracy, and high data collection rate, there is no other industrial or military facility in the world capable of performing the MESA mission. Thank you.